he inherited his powers from a visit to another dimension. Let's find out who is the spot. His true name is Jonathan Own. Jonathan attended MIT and was roommates with Quentin Beck, who later became the villain Mysterio. He became a research scientist and eventually became employed by Kingpin. A battle occurred at Kingpin's headquarters, which involved the duo Cloak and Dagger. Afterwards, Own discovered his scientific equipment had been able to pick up Cloak's energy signature. Upon analyzing it, he determined the energy was emanating from another dimension. So he began working on a way to reproduce the energy. He hoped to find a way to mimic Cloak's abilities. As he used his duplicator, it overheated, causing a large circle of darkness to appear in the lab. Own stepped inside of the circle and passed out. When he came to, he found himself in a black and white spotted dimension. He was fortunate enough to be able to find the hole he had entered the dimension from and made his way back to it and crawled through it. As he exited the portal back into his lab, he realized his body had changed to mimic the spot dimension. He began experimenting with the spots and found that each one was a dimensional portal. He also learned that he can take off the spots and place them on any surface. He can even suspend them in midair. He can transport all or just parts of his body, which allows him to simultaneously attack his target from multiple portals. They also protect him from concussive blows as the blows pass right through into another dimension. When he combines all the spots together, it allows him to return to his human appearance. He made the decision to keep his newfound abilities to himself and not tell the Kingpin about them. A short time later, Spider-Man and Black Cat showed up at Fisk headquarters to confront the Kingpin. Seeing the opportunity to test his new powers in the field, Own met the duo on the roof. He used a portal to send Black Cat a few blocks away and then announced himself as the spot to Spider-Man, which sent Spider-Man into a bout of laughter. But Spider-Man wasn't laughing for long. The spot used his abilities to avoid Spider-Man and attack him from multiple angles. Just as the Black Cat made her way back to the rooftop, the spot warned the duo not to harass Kingpin again or he would destroy them and then depart it. The Spot's second encounter with Spider-Man didn't go quite the same way. This time, Spider-Man baited the Spot into removing and using the majority of his spots, leaving himself vulnerable to Spider-Man's blows. After being hit by Spider-Man, the Spot retreated into a portal and rethought his idea of becoming a super criminal for hire. The Spot has since gone on to be a member of the misfit criminal group, the Spider-Man Revenge Squad, work for MODOK, and been a member of the Hood's gang, just to name a few of his adventures. He has been killed numerous times, but has always come back. Well, that's the origin of the spot. I hope you enjoyed it. As always, I appreciate you taking the time out of your busy day to stop by the channel and check out these videos. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you again real soon. I'm out. Peace.